cool. They are a different type of lipstick because when you see this, you would expect me to be holding up a crayon of some sort, right? Well, it's not. Do you see the tip on this? There's actually a hole here where you can squeeze out product and this comes out almost like a liquid cream form. And what I did is I actually put all the colors Ooh. on the back of my hand. I know it looks like an art project. I, I love, love this so much. <laughs> and what I did is I actually mixed up <laughs> Um, the bright colors with the nudes so that you can see them alternating. Right over here, I'm gonna give you the different names so that you can choose these at beautyiq.com, but they are all gorgeous. If you are in love with this first one on the left-hand side of your screen, that one's called Naked Pink. It's beautiful. Check out this next one. That one is called Papaya. So bright and happy. That next nude that you're seeing there, that one's called Perfect Nude, and it is the perfect nude. Right here down the middle, this gorgeous hot shade, that's hot tangerine. Next to that, we have for you the gorgeous English rose, which looks like a velvety soft rose. Next to that, we've got azalea, which has a very special story because azalea is actually named after Tia's own daughter, which we love. <laughs> Um, this next to last product right over here, that's vintage pink. And then last but not least, cherry. I just want to bite into cherry. Yes. <laughs> but 28 bucks, free shipping and handling. These are gorgeous. And Tia, I know that this is one of your favorite products and you you just went right to applying it. I did. You know, I added a little azalea. <laughs> <laughs> but tell us why you love this so much. So I love this because it's easy to use. You can actually see how much product you're using, but it's like your lip pencil is incorporated into your lipstick. So you're getting bold color. It's a creamy matte, but what's really gorgeous is that it's not so matte that it's drying your lips out or within a couple of hours you're like, Ooh. like it leaves your, your lips looking full, creamy, hydrated. You're getting full coverage and it just glides on. I mean, even without a mirror, Wow. You can just apply. Lovely. Um, and I love that the applicator allows you to define and blend the color at the same time. So um, Samantha actually has on our vintage pink, which I started um, the show out with. And Brittany? Brittany is wearing, I believe, papaya. Yes. She's giving you that bold color. And you know what I love, especially when we think of like summer makeup, I love when you can just put on a bold lip, um, a little mascara and bronzer and go. Like a bold lip is just a signature look. It's amazing. And this texture is just really comfortable for all shaped lips. You don't necessarily need a lip pencil with it yeah. to make it look amazing. And I want to say that, you know, in my kind of viewing of these shades, the nudes are not as ultra glossy as the, you know, brights. Like the brights are a little bit more glossier. Yeah, they have more of a velvety finish, which is, it's nice because then it, 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 it kind of minimizes seeing texture in the lip. The nudes definitely are a little flatter in their appearance, but what's nice is they're nudes that are flattering to all lip colors and skin tones. Ooh, I just love all of these <laughs> and they are so blendable. And when you see, look at this, look at Samantha. Um, she just looks so pretty. First of all, she's got the thunderstorm on the eyes, guys. If you're wondering like, ooh, I love that, um, that eyeshadow, that's thunderstorm. And then of course, the lips beautifully done. Um, and she's wearing, is that the English rose again that she's wearing or? Vin Vintage pink. Vintage pink. Yeah. Very, very pretty. Um, but you know what's really nice, guys? Check these out. I've got the colors on the back of my hands. If you picked up any of the pots, the pot rouges that have the blush, that's kind of like a beautiful cream blush, look at how they all work. Every one of these just really works with one another. And you can play and you can have fun and you can just really have that bright, gorgeous, summery look to your makeup with just a couple of pops of color. So those pot rouges are available at beautyiq.com. And then of course, all of these shades are available at beautyiq.com as well. Remember, there are eight shades to choose from, four of them are going to be nudes. Four of them are these bright, gorgeous pops of color. And today you get them with free shipping and handling, so pick them up here right now. Um, but you know what I love about these is that no matter what your personality, I think we've got the shade for you. Right? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And what I love about them is it's a comfortable way of moving into wearing a full color, bold lip color that's very wearable and flattering. And it feels good on your lips too. I can imagine these feel really creamy. <laughs>
Yes. So guys, listen, if you want this, pick it up right now. Um, at beautyiq.com, you could see all eight of the shades. But let's take a look at Samantha's before photo, okay? This is how she walked onto the set. This is her fresh face. She is beautiful, of course. However, we all might want to, you know, kind of freshen up our summer makeup look, jazz it up a little bit, get a little bit of a bronze glow, a highlight, and maybe some pops of color. Well, you know what? Let's take a look at Samantha now and see her transformation. She is beautiful. But you know what I love is that it's not a different person. Yes. You know, I love like summer makeup, natural makeup doesn't mean it has to be dramatic. It's like makeup that looks like you, but just a little better. Yeah, that's what we all want, right? Me 2.0. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. All right, so um, you're seeing her before, again, on guys, on the right-hand side of the screen, and then, of course, her after. Just to remind you, we started off the show with that skin perfecter. We followed up with the foundation and the bronzing powder. Then we added the pot rouge, the highlighting powder, the gel sparkle, and then, of course, mascara and that liquid lipstick. Here's Britney's before photo. Here's her fresh face. She is gorgeous, but you know what? We can always bring it up just a little bit more, right? And get a beautiful sun-kissed glow to the skin. And I love the drama that she added with the pop of color on the lips, right? Yes. <laughs> Now remember guys, we started off with that Skin Perfector and that is the base of our, you know, everything. With Bobbi Brown Cosmetics, we always wanna have some great skincare products on our face. Yes. And then we wanna follow up with all of those great color cosmetics. And all of them are available right now on beautyiq.com. If you go there, click the items that are recently on air and you can see everything that we presented in the show. But before we leave, I'm gonna say a big thank you to Tia Hebron. Thank you, thank you, thank you so thank much. Thank you for having Bobby Brown back. Oh, we love having you here. We love having you specifically here too, thank Tia, you. because you are just such a wealth of knowledge and a joy to be with. Um, and guys, follow her on Instagram, Tia Hebron on Instagram. All right, so don't go anywhere um, because we've got more beauty for you tonight. I'm headed out of the studio, but I'm gonna be watching from my iPad. Uh, and you know what? It's gonna be worth it because Elise is gonna be here with